If you are passionate about life, you will fall in love with Chenzhou. Chenzhou, a city you must visit at least once in your lifetime. American Brian Linden, a homestay practitioner in China, demonstrates his agreement with this statement through his actions. Taking the opportunity of the launch of his book A Village at a Time, he visited Chenzhou the third time. Hey Brian, and is this your first time you visit this temple? No, no. So I how don't. do you like the two pagodas? Are they still the same? <laughs> I think so. You know, the two pagodas represent something that I feel in China we often don't see. Hello, hello. Sengi hao ma? Kui ma? Hao. Sengi xin long. Brian was as cheerful as 30 years ago when he first visited Chenzhou. Just reminding the world of how open China has always been. Yes, exactly. And this is this is a good example. When you、yes. go in there and you see the Hindu, when you see the mosques, when you see the Tianzhu Jiao, this is shows the inclusiveness of China. Exactly. Where else in the world can you go and see that in such a small area? America doesn't have this, you know. So this is something that I feel is very, very important in preserving. Kind of in some way, the the surroundings, you know, Tranjo should stand for very much for China. Hasso and Basso is the best perfume the city wears. Exploring the streets and alleys here provides you with the most intuitive way to learn about this city. I just love these. And do you know why they make it into the shape of this fish? This is, this is actually a car. Okay, Liu. Liu, yes, it represents the shape of our historical History,、yeah. center. I think this kind of thing represents Chinese history. This is just like this story, do you understand? Yes. So this I can't buy. I have to buy it from somewhere. In this historic city's core area, these streets and alleys have been restored to showcase their old-fashioned charm. Continuing the historical context. While injecting new vitality into the old buildings through various business forms, now we try to reconstruct, renovate some of these traditional buildings. Okay. To show its vitality again. It's very hard for somebody to come in and do this alone. Yes. So it's been really nice that the government has provided us with this kind of this kind of setting. Yes. Like here, everything—the wires have been buried. You know,、yes. the sewage is all taken care of. So that's incredible. How about let's go take a sip of Chenzhou flavor? Okay, Chenzhou where?、Tea. Where would you like、here. to go? This place. Wow. Yeah, this is my friend's tea house. It's a historical building,、wow. and he just renovated. Let's take a look. Perfect. This way. Hello, hello, Lin、hey, 老师。你好，你好，林老师，你好，你好，你好你好欢迎。来，老师，我们以茶代酒。谢谢，谢谢，欢迎来泉州。嗯，嗯，好喝。<笑>我们现在看的那个风景，我觉得太漂亮了。<笑>这个可能全球最美的一个，是不是？可以这么说吧。一个窗户，对，<笑>那么好。这么说吧，我们就看那个开元寺，真的很美。这个我经常说，泉州不是中国的，泉州是世界的。世界的。对，它是一个非常包容的一个城市，对不对,对,对 ？Brian is the founder of hotel brand The Linden Center in China. In his opinion, a successful hotel should offer customers easy access to a genuine form of experiential and cultural tourism. Obviously, he finds someone sharing the same opinion here. We, 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 但实际上我们是很团结，然后就大家一起请客人去看，来看的时候客人就满。The city itself has so much 潜力 ，you know potential. Yes. And what I feel in some way is we need to let that potential 
Jian Shi 的 ，you know authentically and and 诚恳的、yes. 展现 ，you know talk and、yes. share. All I'm doing is taking the reality of China, the real stories of China, the authenticity, the people stories. This Yo Peng Zi Yuan Fan Lai Bu Yi Le Hu, and I think Tranzhou is a great represent representation of that.